guys were trying to read a Guinness World Record. Come for an STI test. Five minutes. Well, there are a few Guinness World Records that make quite the splash, as this one does. I'm here at the University of Ottawa, where they're holding the P to C challenge, encouraging students to get tested for sexually transmitted infection. We're doing this huge campaign around uh, awareness for gonorrhea and chlamydia. Uh, rates have uh, been going up for the past, I'd say, eight years in the 15, 29 year old. And so we thought it was very important to try and raise awareness about that. But we're doing it in a fun way. We're trying to beat the Guinness World Record for the most gonorrhea and chlamydia testing done single venue in 24 hours. So we're having four schools compete against each other. We have Carleton University, Ottawa U, La Cité Collégiale, and Algonquin College. So it's, this is happening in all four campuses all at the same time. I think stigma is a very vivid now. Like people are, you know, embarrassed either to, you know, go to the doctor to get tested or to go on some kind of birth control or even to use condoms. People just don't like it anymore. And yeah, so I, I, it makes sense that why STDs are on a rise. And it's just around one o'clock here, and they've got about 120 people who have signed up to get tested. The students that I've spoken with said that convenience was a major factor in their decision. Um, I thought it would be really great to partake in uh, breaking a world record actually and I, it was really convenient because I had, was walking by and I actually had to go to the bathroom so I'm like this is great actually and yeah it was, it was a great opportunity to get tested without having to go to the clinic and everything like that. Yeah, I mean you should definitely take it if you're sexually active and even if you're not you should take it to help the school beat the world record.